up guys welcome back to my channel it's Gabby again today's video I am going to be attempting to do a kind of neon eye look um, I have little miss who is awake and didn't want to sleep for too long so she might interrupt a few times but yeah um, as you all know once I get to 2,000 subscribers I'm going to be doing a giveaway so make sure you share this video around and tell your friends about it so I can get that underway so I'm just going to be using <laughs> Are you right there? <laughs> so I'm just going to be using the Anastasia Modern Renaissance palette today. Do you want to show them? Can you hold it up? Hold it up. Hold it up. Look, like this. This one. And I don't really want your dirty fingers on it. Thanks, Baba. So I'm just going to be using this palette today. It does, I really, really wanted to wait until I got my NYX. Um, Brights palette which I obviously don't have but I'm just going to be using this and I'm just going to try and create a neon look even though it's not so bright look you can't even see yourself <laughs> and I'm also going to be using this NYX white liquid liner just a couple of brushes and also some black eyeliner so what I'm going to do, I've already prepped my eyes, um, but what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do like a normal eyeshadow type look, um, just a little bit more dramatic, a little, bit, a little bit more darker, and then I'm going to try and turn it into a neon look. This obviously works better if you use a brighter color, but I don't really have any bright colors at all. So I'm just going to try and create, I don't know, maybe a soft neon look with this. So let's see how it goes anyway, and um, yeah, let's get started. So first things first, um, we always go in first with a transition shade. This particular shade is called Raw Sienna and I just blend that out until I'm happy with it. I then just work into my crease a slightly darker shade. Um, for this one I use the Red Ochre shade. These are all out of the Modern Renaissance palette. Um, then in my corners and into my creases I did a little bit darker with the Venetian Red. And as you can see right here, I am starting to build up the pigment up towards my brow bone and I'm just using the colour Love Letter. I use a more dense brush for this one because I do want that to be really bright for the neon effect. And then blend. So now it is time to do the white line with the eyeliner. Um, it's really, really hard to follow your brow bone shape and get that perfect curve on both sides. Um, as you can see here, I have already been out of the line, but I just go ahead and try and fix that up. Um, just remember, asymmetry is also beautiful, girls. So while I was off camera just then, I decided to put some eyeliner and lashes on um, just so I didn't have to do that last so you could just see the finished product as soon as I was finished with the neon part of it. Um, little Miss decided to get bored while I was doing that and had my back turned and <laughs> why? It could be worse, but it's still not ideal. I should be the one trying, sweetheart, not you. Well, let's just get on with this. I now start to pat on the same color love letter onto the white so you can do the blended neon effect. Um, it would just look like a plain white line if you weren't to blend the shadow color in. Do this until you get the desired blend. Okay, so that is my attempt at a neon eye look. Um, I think I did pretty good considering I'm not really, you know, that great at trying out new things. Um, a lot of reviews I've seen that this eyeliner um, tends to come out a lot thicker, which it was actually... Do you want to sit up on my lap? It was actually not too bad for me. Um, the thing with it, though, you might be able to see is that it cracked. Um, so I did actually go and set that with some Laura Mercier powder just so it didn't <laughs> What are you doing? Just so it didn't smudge um, But yeah, anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I hope you learned something. I don't know if I did it properly um, I think it looks okay, but 
Anyway, guys, if you did like this video, please go and give it a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button and don't forget the little bell so you get notified every time I upload, which is twice a week, Mondays and Thursdays. And until next video, say see you then. Now say bye. Look, say bye. Bye. Say bye. Can you say bye?